Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to more Tribal Island, otherwise known as uh, Crusader Kingdom of Ireland. Uh, I've just noticed, um, this is Agnatic uh, Seniority, and this has uh, Medium Crown Authority, and yeah, okay, fair enough. Then I noticed this button here. This, this is uh, the Royal Laws of Ireland, and that's still Agnatic Gavelkind. So that's why, that's why the... Uh, the, the Kingdom of Ireland and uh, Connacht is going to a different person. So we're going to enact uh, succession by seniority. Uh, and uh, that's going to hold everything together. It's all going to go to the uh, same person, which is Duke Ovar of Munster. And yeah, it's great. Um, obligations? No, nothing. Okay. I won't have feudal taxation, I don't think. Ah, uh, who knows? I, I think I'm happy with uh, things at the moment because that sorted right our uh, our succession problem out. It's all going to go to the same place now, and what can happen is we can hand out the uh, everything and as people die it comes back to us and then we can hand it back out again so we it allows us to have a large amount of control over what happens with our uh, our kingdom at least that's the theory of it anyway I, I've seen people you know like all kinds of laws with regards to inher inheritance like elective gavel kind elective monarchy uh, Primogenitor is, again, good. It's, yeah, it, it is. It's, it's interesting, and I'm just going to have a run with this for the moment. Okay. So we've got everything raised right now. We're just moving our army back into friendly territory so that when we disband them, they all return home. That's our retinue. Okay, nice. Okay, so with uh, things being built in Jerusalem, oh, the other thing was we went over our demands limit with uh, because we picked up this barony, the barony of Ramallah. So let's let's just have a look here at something. Hmm. Uh, so what I did was I just put it back in the hands of a, a, a local uh, local person. So he's he's an Irish Catholic. Cool. And that'll actually come back to us. Huh. What about this one? Will this one come? Oh wow, okay. So we, we get all of the baronies coming back to us, all the castles come back to us. Uh, as well as all the provinces and Damn. That's uh that's actually pretty cool. Uh what do we want here? Retinue size? Yeah, I think we want retinue size because we want to increase our standing armies. Uh, we've got 1.1k and we can't build another Galaglass yet. Hmm. Look, they can uh, plot and scheme all they want. At the end of the day, it all comes back to the liege. So, uh, with those law changes. Oh. What happened? We got, we got kidnapped. The Earl of Brefney is a little bit shitty with us. Ah. Uh, why is that? Outraged by succession law change? Hey, at the end of the day, stiff shit, bruh. <laughs> uh, we're going to... He's in Dublin right now, and we're going to send him to Brefney. Because we're going to keep people happy. Yeah, he's about the shittiest with us. And give it, you know, 30 years, the uh, they'll, they'll get over it. 
they will get over it. And, and it's these young men that are upset by the, uh, yeah, by the changes. Wait, why does that go? Why is that still agnotic? I thought that this would change the entire laws of the kingdom, but apparently it doesn't. The Duchy of Meath still has a different set of inheritance laws. Strange. Very strange. I would have thought that it would apply from the top down, but apparently it doesn't. Hmm. Bugger. Alright, so we've got stuff building, things happening. We ended up having another daughter, which is great. This guy's pissy. Because, yeah, we changed the succession law. He went from being the potential king of... Uh, King of Jerusalem to just nothing, <laughs> like an earl, uh, in the blink of an eye. At the end of the day, it sucks, you know. But that's what we're going to do to keep our uh, our kingdom together and exercise some long term control over it. We've got titles that can be graded there, but we're not going to do that. Are there any factions? There are factions. Uh, lower crown authority, gavel kind succession. Double kind succession as well. Hey, look. They can uh, carry on all they want. I don't think they'll succeed. Sounds good to me. Duke of Franconia, will he form an alliance with us? No. He's just the car. Oh, wow, okay, he's fallen a long way then. Because he was the, uh, the king, or a duke, before, but now he's just a... Uh, a lowly count. And this guy's the king. Interesting. Oh, it looks like someone... And you know, West Francia took over Burgundy. Okay, that explains it. Who is your liege? Crete. Holy War for Crete. The Emirate of the Sky... How many troops has he got? 4,590? Could we take him? We'd have to use our own armies? No, we couldn't take him. Because our, uh, our levies are fairly decimated again from the Holy War. Defending against the... Uh, that Jihad really took it out of, uh, out of the kingdom. Western's host is going after the... Kingdom of Scotland, okay, interesting. So none of these are likely to succeed anytime soon. They're trying to lower crown authority, but again, it's it's unlikely to succeed. Uh, they need more men. Alright, so... We have a whole bunch of pretenders. King Muadak the Great has died. Aged uh, 53. He died of depression. Poor bugger. And we now have King Ovar. King of Jerusalem. King of Ireland. And uh, has a whole bunch of counties. And a whole bunch of duchies as well. Right. That's fine. He's 48. Oh, 
we need to uh, offload some of these things. We're no, we don't need to fabricate a claim anymore. We are the king. Our learning is very high, but our, uh, our diplomacy is actually kind of shit. We don't want to become the spy master either. We want to increase our diplomacy if we can. Technological advance. Here we go. What does this give us? Piety, prestige, and short reign. I want tolerance, first and foremost. Because it, it... We've got two different religions, you know. Um... Town infrastructure? Maybe. Or you might just hold on for castle? City fortifications? So it's mustering grounds for... Hmm. We'll do heavy infantry. We will do cavalry. Let's go trade practices, sure. Okay. Uh, Demands is too big by three. That's fine. We'll get to that. Uh, Andronikos can be our um, our chancellor, as he was for the previous king. We'll appoint our marshal to be um, Macbeth. Uh, you can not lead troops anymore. You can train them. We have a steward who is collecting taxes. Yet yeah, nice. He's scheming. That's great. Potentially, we could actually get him to uh, scheme somewhere else. Maybe even stop people from. Uh, joining factions. Okay. So let's have a look at our vassals, see who's pissed off with us. Pretender and claimant. Have I created a massive issue? So this guy's 38. Title, Climate, and Pretender and Climate. So I'm giving all these guys strong claims by the looks of it. I knew there'd be a downside. Strong claims on both, yep. Uh-oh. This could be bad. <laughs> I could be about to learn what seniority... Um, Succession does. We're going to repay that loan. Well, we can abdicate the throne. This is from a mod, by the way. Earl of Brefni is pretty uh, pretty upset with us. I think he's probably the first one we uh, we start to work on. Okay. Go. Right, so what do we hold in the homeland? Uh, Munster, Connacht, Thomond, Ossery. So we own quite a few here. Sorry, it was. I thought I held Tier Connell. Apparently, I don't. Oh, it's the Duchy of Connacht. Okay, county. Those two counties. Got some weak claims. Okay. I think we need to find someone to give this away to. 
In fact, that might be a way of... Um, Yeah, let's let's grant some of these titles to the uh, the pretenders because that could hold us together. Yeah, forty opinion, sure, we'll take it. The Earl of Desmond, he only holds the one, so let's grant him another title. Ossery, that sounds good. We're at six of five. Earl of Negev. Let's uh, grant him a title. Hebron, maybe? Baker, Beersheb. Jaffa. Ascalon. Which one's Ascalon? That one's Ascalon. Beersheb is... That one. Let's give him Beersheb. Alright, so we're back to the demands limit. And our vassals should be a little bit happier with us. Duchy of Connacht. We can give him that. There we go. Where's the Dutch... The Duke of Connacht. Where is he gone? There he is. Decides the Kingdom of Ireland. Oh, come on, dude. You're getting a bit big for your britches there. Anyway, the Earl of Durham is now our most disliked, so we'll move our Chancellor there and look to improve relations with him at the next opportunity. Okay, so this guy wants to arrange a marriage with our daughter. Sure. Done. I'd assume that would get us a pact. Yeah, nice. King of Abyssinia. Nice. Where's Abyssinia? Oh, okay, that's a little tiny kingdom down south. There I was thinking, oh, he said king. <laughs> he must be good. Ah, <laughs> uh, shit. Okay, um, let's, uh, let's hand out some stuff. Master of the horse, sure. High almoner, sure. Cupbearer. Cupbearer can be uh, you, because you're a little bit shitty. And you can be my seneschal. The Earl Connery of Kerak. Yeah, that's two incompetent commanders right there. Alrighty. The Duchy of Ascalon. Aha, so that's what it should be there. As we're the king, I believe we're the only ones who can create these. Uh, my common... What? I've gained the humble trait. Okay, cool. As we, we have a, a lover. Ain de Thormon. What is this house? Okay, somehow she's created her own house. Don't ask me how. So 
So what does this guy want? What is what is his problem? He's just a uh, he's ambitious as well, which isn't helping matters. Okay. I have a finger of St. John. Okay. Uh, he doesn't like us, so he's not going to. Uh, he's not going to go for that. I think we're pretty good for the moment. I do want to take Crete, though. Oh, they're already defending against uh, a host. Let's do it. Let's uh, let's go to war because he's uh, he's battling at the moment, and we just need some fleet levies. Move more into the Sea of Palestine, and then we'll uh, we'll see what we can take. Sixteen hundred men. Okay, that's not really enough. Um. All right. So here's some more from our vassals. These ones up here can just expand. We don't need them. Alright. And then what we're going to do is that we're going to raise our personal levies. And our vassals' le levies. But only in Jerusalem. Everything up here can just disband. It's only 500 men. Where are we going? Just here. Okay, cool. On you get, laddies. So we can take 3,100. It's about what we've got re... It's no longer... What happened to him? Did he inherit something, maybe? Yeah, it looks like he inherited something. Okay. Oh, he's in hiding, okay. County of Hebron. Not this time. So we've already got 3,100 men on there. We're going to move them to the eastern Mediterranean. Gallagher's training grounds have been completed. Nice. On you go, boys. Alliance is being formed. Hmm. Ah, there we go. Do we win? We should win. Nice. Can we ransom? No, we can't, bugger. We're just, uh, we're piling in right now. We might be able to win this. Who is this guy? Can he be ransomed? No. Okay, you can just rot then. We're chasing both armies back and forth right now. Okay, wonderful. Fine. Can he be ransomed? Nope. Okay. Why can nobody be ever ransomed? Ah, dang it. I just want money. Losing eight gold in this conquest, but that's fine. So we should be able to wipe out both armies here. Okay, we're going to split this in half. 
Uh, we're going to send one army here and leave that army there. Oh, shit. We don't have enough men. That'd be right. Okay. So let's just stay there. All right. Can you... I'm here, damn it. I want you in this province. Holy shit. How hard is it? Oh, what's this? King of Bulgaria. Please. Alright, looks like we're going to stay in this province and we're going to siege this. Hopefully we win this first. Hopefully. They're just going to ping pong that army back and forth. Dude, you've lost. What does he hold? He holds that one. Oh, shit. So we picked the wrong um, holding to siege. But we'll go with it. Hopefully we, uh, we win the uh, race. I got 75 war score and we hold someone prisoner. Hopefully this gives us the occupation score that we need. We've got about 10 months before we have to stop the war from lack of monies. Just speed things up a bit because nothing's happening. That'd be good if we can take Crete. What's this? Hebron. Okay, so he's targeting this. Can I? They already have contracts. Fuck. We're in trouble. Well, uh, he hasn't got that many men, actually. We might be okay. Uh, I'll let them sort it out themselves. That never ends well. Normally get chickens thrown at us. Okay, so that's what they want here. Hebron. Has been a success. They like us better. Who likes us the least currently? The Earl of Durham. Okay. So, we'll get you to come and uh, cozy up with him. Get him to like us more. Alrighty, so here... Aha. Uh -huh. That's a 500... Um, 500 strong army, and we will be able to take that out with a 1500 strong army. Right, that's... Okay, that's another one. 93% right now. Can we ransom? We can. Does it give us war score? That's not him. Ransom! Done. Perfect. Right, so we've still got a little bit to go there before we can claim Crete. Uh, we will move this army here. Good. We won that. Where is it going? Bersheb. We'll just keep kicking the, b the butt of that army. Because we'll make sure that... Uh, oh, the Duchy of Normandy. Okay, cool. Uh, Northumberland, rather. County of Kerak. Oh wow. That was this one. That's now Catholic. Oh my god, that's so good. Uh, where is he? 
let's uh, let's get Jaffa now because that's still Shia. But we have Jerusalem and um, Karak both being uh, Catholic now, which means the revolt risk is now only 2%, and that's just for the culture. So that's good. Keep an eye on that siege. We can do that, actually, by the outliner. Okay, that's fine. Uh, subject has converted. Cool. Oh, okay. There's the bigger army. So we're just going to have to avoid this for the moment. Uh, that's the siege done. We're going to offer peace. Uh, we're going to take all other titles under the Duchy of Crete. Nice. Wait, what? Why? Why is this? Why did that split? Hello? Hello? What is it? What is this? I thought it was the entire thing. Apparently not. Well, that's unfortunate. I have to move my boats over one uh, to grab all my men. Okay. Everyone aboard the boats, lads. Move to the Sea of Jerusalem, or rather the Sea of Palestine. Um, Holy Relic, yep, sure. Yeah, Revolt Whisk, good, I like it. Okay, we'll get them both of the, uh, the armies to meet in Hebron and then continue on south and hopefully take out this, uh, this invading force. If we had more money, we could create another retinue. Alright, we'll do that in a little while. Okay. Oh, we do hold this. What? What? I do not understand. I do not get it. Oh shit. Alright, so this guy... This guy, what does he want? We haven't given him anything, so let's, let's grant him a landed title. Uh, of Kanea. Uh, and he can have that. And he can be happy with us. Right. <laughs> That's that. Uh, this this lot can go into a port and then I'll disband them. Hopefully we win this battle. Uh, that Jihad has failed. Good. Yes, we got it. 1200 men, good. Where's this guy going, Elliot? Okay, we will meet him there and we will beat him again. Press our advantage while we've got it. It's another five wall score, good. Where does this guy, where is this guy from? He's all the way down there, what? He's part of Egypt. He's marched a long way for nothing then. Uh, Elliot, okay. Basically, we just want to smash his army down to a size that he can't actually threaten us. Uh, there we go. Good. So we'll move everything back. We're going to have a ticking war score. Control C, Bron, yep, good. And uh, basically, we're just going to let that war tick out. Uh, disband the troops. Good. Now that should recover our... Ooh. That's another province converted already. Uh, 
All right, we'll go for Ascalon next. We need a regent of uh, Jerusalem. Mugron looks good. Wow, he's so happy with us. <laughs> he's, he's like, yeah, I want stuff, but damn, dude, you the man. <laughs> Oh dear. I'm going to stop this video here. It's already 35 minutes long. I'm having so much fun. <laughs> I need to uh, take a break and uh, I'll see you again very shortly as we continue uh, Tribal Island, which has turned into Kingdom of Jerusalem. Yeah, anyway, fun times. Can we... I wish that... Uh... I wish that uh, we were able to just like sort this out and be like, hey, brah, you, you take these, but pay me gold. I'm, I'm happy with that. 